Welcome. <clears throat> in this video, we are going to take a, take a look at uh, animations in flat. So first, let's say the opacity animation. So we import flat and from flat, we import container, elevated button and the page. So in the main function, what we would like to do is to create a container and this container will have the width set to 150, the height set to 150 and the background color set to blue and the border radius set to 10 and the animate opacity set to 300 and we will have the animate property or rather opacity function and the c dot opacity is equal to zero if c dot opacity is equal to one else one and we use the c dot update then we can use the page dot add and add our c the elevated button which will have the animate opacity and the on click we will have the animate opacity function and we use the flat.app with the target main and the view equals flat web browser so let's go and run it and once we have the web browser open we should have the opacity and it is clickable and we can change it as we desire all right so now what we could also do is to basically rotate animation and scale animation so let's create a, another container let's call this D and it should have the width on 100 the height on 100 and the background is blue the border radius should be 5 and uh, the scale should be the scale scale equals 1 and we need to import the scale from flat transform and uh, <clears throat> we would have the animate scale and <clears throat> we will call this uh, how should we call it animation that animation 600 and bounce out all right now we will have the animate function and uh, we make the c that scale equal to 2 and use the c that update <coughs> and we will use the page that vertical alignment to be center and the page that horizontal alignment equal to center and the page that spacing equal to 30 and we would like to add the elevated button and say that animate scale 
and this should be the animate on click and uh, we have to import the animation here and if we run our example we have now two elements the opacity is still working and something seems to be off I should use the D scale equal to and D update so let's rerun it and now we should be able to do this so here if we scale it up that should be fine so <coughs> should be 2 if C dot scale is equal to 1 and it should be D as 1 now let's stop it and go back and now we have the option to bounce it there and back and uh, technically that was all I wanted to show you about animation see you in the next one